Hey, what's going on, people? I'm Kevin Hanchard, and you're watching A Talk of the Clones on Space.ca, and I'm interviewing my boy, Mr. Christian Brune, who plays the lovable Donnie Hendrix on our little show. And I got a few questions for you right here. Aww. So let's just, uh, What let's, dialect is that? That's, uh, that's Mr. Sagan. Oh, okay, it's Mr. Sagan. Yeah, so here we go. Donnie has pretended to be married to Helena, and he sold drugs and soap, and basically killed a guy for Allison. Is there anything that she could ask him to do that he'd say no to? First thing that came to mind, inappropriate. It's not gonna go there. Uh, second thing that comes to mind is uh, Donnie would do anything for Helena. What I like is that you had a Freudian there. You said you'd do anything for Helena. Yeah, because the question is about Helena. Would I do anything for her? No, you killed the guy for Allison. Oh. You, you, you pretended to be married to Helena for Allison. Oh, okay. I thought it was you about said you'd Helena. Do it for Helena. See, when he talks, I Paging listen to Dr. like Freud. Half, I listen to the first half of the sentence, and then I just trail off into my Paging thoughts because he's so Dr. boring. Freud. Donnie describes Dr. Leakey's exhumed corpse as smelling like hot garbage juice. What do I smell like, Donnie? Or Christian, whoever you are in the moment. I'm currently Christian. That line is based off of your current smell, which is hot garbage juice. Um, Allison is one of those people who's good at everything. What the hell is Donnie good at? He watches a mean game of golf. He can drink beers. Good. Good. He can do one squat to pick something up, like a solid squat. Like a deep squat. A, a deep, deep squat, squat. but he might go like uh, in the process. And throws back out. And throws back out and, and poop his pants a bit. But he'll get back up, he'll finish the squat. He'll eventually, with the assistance of others, get back up. So he can do that real good. Um, and other than that, he's just a damn good dad and lover. In that order. That's based off of me. He's a better dad than lover. Yeah. In 15 or 20 years, when Donnie and Allison's kids are undergoing extensive psychotherapy, what event do you think they'll point to as the moment where everything went wrong? Probably when um, art stripped in front of them for no reason. No, it's a good reason. Is that a spoiler? Has that come out yet by the time this airs? It's a good reason. That scene? You'll see. It's it, a bit weird. It's it comes, comes out of nowhere. It was an interrogation. At church, and though, had, of all places. They had valuable information. They're kids, man. People really like spoilers. What single word could you say that would give away the entire plot of the new season? Do you have a word big enough to describe the entire season? I'll, that give I'll a use a word you used earlier in an interview. <laughs> um, capsulate. Cap it capsulize. It, it cap capsulize. It ca <laughs> the world has had enough capsulation, and we don't need people running around making up words that don't make any sense. You can't communicate like that. But that word definitely sums up this season. Listen, you need to stop before I bust a capsulate in your ass, all right? That's how we do. Do I have to work with this guy? Yes, you do. Yes, you do.